Hello and welcome back to another episode of Gears Tactics. My name is Saiken and today we'll continue our blind playthrough of Insane Difficulty. And I got that vague feeling that we're nearing towards uh, the end or towards a really, really big uh, thing. Act 3, Chapter 6, Vantage Point is the name of the game. Gabe and Rhea are required for that and we got to fight uh, all the way to the laboratory. So let's remove the guys that are uh, that are not important. We're going to use Quincy here, our tank, and that's already a really good team. So who is going to be our last soldier on this one? We're either going with second heavy, second scout, or can we recruit a sniper? We can recruit a sniper. That's exactly what we're going to do. Let me just take care of that recruitment real quick. Okay, we got ourselves a sniper just freshly hired and her name is Emily Taxi Masters. Hopefully she's going to be the taxi uh, that takes us to a successful mission. And I started to pick her up with Lucky Streak, which is a skill set that we haven't seen so far. We had the precision shot that was eh, so and so headhunter. I'd really ne never uh, took uh, took off. So let's see if the marksman setup is any good. And I wanted to just uh, support that marksman setup with a bit of hunter. So what we're going to see is we have still the precision shot. I don't think that I'm going to use it that often, but we got weak spots. So as soon as someone is not full health, 10% crit. This one here might be an interesting one uh, because it is one action for with a relatively high cooldown for plus 100% damage bonus, first blood, uh, and that only works against full health targets. I could see how that is actually helpful. Matter of fact, I could even see how the other sniper, uh, Michaela, could uh, just skill into that for for a simple plus 50% damage bonus. It is a skill that I could see. Uh, being used more often. Lucky Streak, whenever the unit uh, scores a critical hit, uh, gains 20% critical hit for the rest of the turn. And I really like this one here, so potentially should maybe reskill that. Unit gets a kill on an enemy with critical hit, 25% chance to restore two actions. So that's potentially the right way to do it. Go all the way to here, take that and that. And on the other hand, I wanted to still have fast fingers for reload, active reload uh, as well for 25% damage. That one is okay in order to not automatically uh, uh, yeah, miss and then needing for to wait for a refresh. I think both of them have their merits. I had good experiences with second, uh, second chance. The active reload, given that we only have three R ammunition, might be better, and then chain shot for additional uh, for additional points. I will just reset. I still have enough tokens, and just optimize that build a tiny bit. The weak spot is actually quite good. I will go up to here and here into killing spree, and then lucky strike, which we wanted to do. Um, reload or second chance. I think we're going with a reload and then getting those extra AP. So far that looks decent. I gave her good equipment so uh, just for now consider that she has like equivalently good gear. Not as good as our prime team but pretty damn good gear and that should be enough for us to take her on this mission. And we got a really strong team here. Rhea plus Gabe will carry that together with uh, Tank. And eventually Taxi will carry her weight as well. So without further ado, let's jump into it and get that party rolling. Reyna gave us a fix on Ukon's lab. But the brute force approach isn't going to cut it. To plan our attack, we need to scout his defenses. Clear out any grubs and get to a vantage point. All right, let's jump into this. It 
seems like a full-fledged clear everything and kill everything mission, which is just exactly what I was looking for. Or ungrubbed. But Ukon's a vigilant one. No way we're sneaking in. We've got to open the gate and clear a path to that overlook. Move out. Good. We can take that, start to take the entirety here. Got a couple of epic cases ready, fair enough. High ground here, which isn't bad for the sniper. And I think... I'm not even sure what our target is. Maybe over here? Yeah, we gotta find that one out. Anyways, time for our All scout. Right. To sprint in. Grub spotted. All units free to engage. Yeah, we gotta be careful here. Don't want any drama. So let's hide uh, Jack before we're being too greedy. They're in a sec. Door panel should be easy to hack. Just gotta clear out the grub traffic. Good. We're hiding. And let's interrupt both of these guys here. Drag out. Okay. Good. Yep. Well, let's see what that sniper could do. It's not even halfway bad. It really paid off that we were investing into accuracy. Sniper moves up. Ready. Time to up your game. Some extra actions. Sniper needs definitely some extra crit chance, so let's take this one here. Improve crit chance. That's more like it. With 85% crit chance and she's not killing him. How is that even a thing? I uh, should have, by the way, Chosen first blood shot. Hmm, too bad. Running dry. All right, hit and kill. That's a free reload. And boy, boy, we got some 100% crit chances here. Running dry. <laughs> Affirmative. And stay down. Awaiting orders. Understood. Okay, we're just going to overwatch here. And that should be fine. He's not going to move all the way over here. Here we go. There's the interrupt I was hoping for. Engage. 
And there's the second interrupt. This lab Ukon's using, you know it well? Sort of. We weren't there long. My father and I were always moving, always hiding. Hiding? From what? Honestly, you. The cog, I mean. I was taught never to trust them. Yeah, well, wish I'd learned that lesson sooner myself. Good. That's a pretty decent hit chance. Let's do first blood. I'm all out. Lock and load. Now then. He really survived that. Oh boy. Good high powered shot. Changing position. Threat neutralized. Gabe needs to kill some. All right. Unfortunately, the grenades just make Heavy it gear. so much easier. Acknowledged. Eyes peeled. Ready. All right. Moving up even further. And some overwatch. Please. Looking up. Thank you. The moment that the guy comes out, he's going to be toast. Yep. And now he's going to take all of the overwatch shots. Scratch one grub. Moving up. Right here. Here goes. All right, that pushes him a bit closer. down there we go Diaz finally got his kill where'd you learn to shoot what's so hard you just point and pull the trigger guess I've wasted a lot of time on the firing range then let's uh open that gate good I mean the prime team actually at this point has a disgusting amount of uh, extra damage that uh, they are dealing they're up I, by the way, completely ignored the secondary Ready to uh, the secondary On option route. here, which gives a Way blue, more. which gives Harder. a blue trinket. All right. But I think Damn, we're pretty much incoming. ready. Time to shred some grub. High powered shot isn't necessary. Yeah, one more turn. Are we reloaded? Yes, we are. Hold the line. Good. Safety Ready, shot. steady, go. through head toward the lookout but stay sharp for more grubs solid work that's all of them everybody get to the lookout 
What? We killed all of them already? And where are the other crates? So there is a second one back there. Damn, in this dusty landscape it is actually quite hard to see where those crates are. I was hoping they would be up here somewhere. Apparently I'm wrong. Hmm. Okay, moving up. Taking our scout first. Rhea is sprinting in. Really, no one there. Hard to believe. Okay. Sniper Here. takes the high ground. Diaz, of course, supports in that effort. I'm just wondering if there is another crate over here somehow. Likely we're going to see some enemies landing. Ukon can't know we're here. No locust witnesses. And leave the last one for me. Oh, don't worry. There's plenty of grubs to go around. For you, maybe. Let's move. All right, one. Good, that's five down. Free cloak. Into a mine. Grenade out. Awaiting orders. Standing by. Hmm, how do we go about that? Ready. Roger that. Moving down here. I think we gotta clean these guys up first. This is definitely going to be an Overwatch um, gig for him. Great. I think that's the right call here. Right. Got your back, soldier.
Good, lock and load for everybody. Plus 50% damage, not that we needed it so far, but now with the higher hit point targets, it's going to become more important. Standing by. So what I was saying is this year we'll force all three of them. Well, let's forget about all three of them. Scratch one grub. Sniper reporting in. Won't be getting up from that. Almost out. I'm all out. Well, so much for that. Time for remote reload for both of you. Right. Headed out. And we are moving closer. Overwatch here. Setting up a perimeter. There's actually no one left. After we, we killed go. all of them. Out for blood here. Up. Hunted one. There you go. Nicely kicked in. And that's a three for one. Two more. Don't let him escape. I'll copy. Moving up. I read you. Still not seeing anything here. All right, Gabe. Okay. That's only the second Worth the of the crates. The question is, where is the last one? Proceeding on foot. Uh huh. It's not here. <laughs> not over here either. I must be. Completely stupid or missing something here. Pretty sure I've gone over it, but my eyes just can't seem to find it. Here we go, up there. Come on. Oh, there it is. Hey. Secure. Go ahead. Affirmative. Good, everybody's just charging towards the exit. Dig in, we've got incoming. There's still going to be more incomings. Let's kick some ass. Not sure. I'm listening. It seems we have pretty much cleaned out the entirety. How did the new sniper perform? I would give it All right. a slightly above Let's average. Uh, the precision shot.
There, through the rocks. Some renovating, huh? It's an asshole factory, all right. In full production. That's a lot of emulsion. Okay, what do you guys want first? The bad news or the really bad news? <laughs> Okay, I was about to say, how did the sniper perform compared to Megala elsewise? I would say the marksman uh, tree up uh, up there was a bit better, uh, quite a bit better than the precision tree on the bottom left side. The precision tree, the idea is great, but that precision shot with the accuracy bonus and uh, the uh, two uh, time units is just too much in my per in my personal perspective you are having a high cooldown and you do have a skill that automatically also penalizes your action economy so both of that together is a bit too much she was doing fine the whole uh the whole uh shot against full health targets was okay i think the streak and the uh, max shot crit damage that was nice and worked out well Jack's almost at level 6, by the way. Gabe did, uh, did well and got some XP also, so that's good. And we got some more epic gear, which is good. Gabe here, 10% crit chance. That's not bad. But plus one movement range in that light build is definitely better. So yeah, thanks, but no thanks. Sit. 40 damage or disrupt. Yeah, that's not close either. Disrupt is too good to not have it. 30 damage, one ammunition, however, looks good. Focus, start of turn, 100% critical chance. Nah, I think we're going to we're going to take that because 100% critical chance for the first hit. That means there is a lot of damage happening with that first strike. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good one. And Quincy here. Yeah, got everything uh, properly set up. Nothing that we need to change. Well, that looks good. What is the next move? Well, that looks like Act 3, Chapter 7. This time it's Reyna and Michaela. I'm not sure how they are always coming up with only two that are allowed, but ah, I suppose that's fine. We still can get tank with us and potentially another support. But that will happen in the next episode. Thanks guys for watching. I appreciate your support. I would like to ask you to leave a comment and a like down below. That helps the video and uh, satisfies the ever so greedy YouTube algorithm. Take care and have a good one. Bye bye.